So I'm on the East Coast, and Alex has a lot of warehouses, but I'm headed to the big warehouse. When it comes to World War II stuff, he's basically got one of everything almost. So I think I might be spending the whole day there. Hey, man. Oh, there you are. How you doing? All right. So this is it. This is pretty cool. Thanks, man. We own the vast majority of our inventory, but some pieces we do have on consignment. So what you're looking at out here, these are machine guns from World War I and World War II. Wow. Got a bunch of antique guns along the walls. So these go from about 1700 all the way up to about 1900. Civil War guns, British guns called blunderbusses used on ships. We've got all different kinds of stuff. And we have a warehouse here that's 25,000 square feet. So we can go through and take a tour? Sure, let's go. All right. So we got a lot of old guns. Um, a lot's sort of an understatement. <laughs> There's about 20,000. These are cool. Yeah, they are. These cannons here are actually on consignment. They're a matched pair of bronze signal cannons from 1697. Are they reproductions? No, they're original. There's not a modern piece or screw on them. They're all iron and wood. They're held together by the correct type of pegs. And the, the barrels themselves are founded just as they would have been done on the bigger scale. Uh, they are dated 1697. We've put bore scopes in them. These are cool. Yeah. So nothing was engraved on these right here? No, they were left blank. I could put my initials on it. You could, yeah. An <laughs> RH right across there. Yeah, or maybe my face. <laughs> <laughs> have you fired him? No, but I'd love to fire him. We're going to the range tomorrow. I can just bring him. Yeah, bring him with you, dude. I'm absolutely in love with these things. I want him sitting in front of my fireplace. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll call the owner and make sure she can come meet us. OK. I'm, for a sale, I'm sure she'd love to. This is just so cool. I love how this is made. Hi. Hey, Jen. Nice to see hey, you. Hey, Alex. Nice to see hey, you. Rick. Nice to meet you, Rick. So these are yours? Yeah, they are. Where did you get these? My husband and I bought them in an estate sale. All right, and did they give you any history on them or anything like that? Yeah, the seller told me that she inherited them from her grandparents. And back in Ireland, apparently they were at an old whiskey distillery. So it was just passed down. OK. Aren't they awesome? They are. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Talk about a double barrel. No, no. <laughs> I've had these cannons for about eight years now. I found Alex because I wanted to sell them, but I didn't really know that much about them or what they were worth. I used to have them in my house because it kind of looked cool and pretty, but now we're redecorating and we just want to get rid of them. So normally signal cannons are only used to make noise because that's a way of communication. But we're also going to fire a projectile out of them. I've got some buckshot. We're going to knock stuff over. So we're going to make noise and knock stuff down. Load her up. All right, back up. All right. So I'm going to pierce the bag of powder. All of that. <laughs> I'm backing up. Fire in the hole. <laughs> yes! Got it! That was awesome. All right, like I'm super impressed. That was better than I thought it would be. So now that we know they work well, I'm going to value these cannons at $20,000. OK. All right. That's it, man. All right, thanks, man. Good luck. OK, so Alex says they're basically worth 20. So let me give you 13 grand for them. Mm, maybe 18? I mean, they're, they're super cool, but I got to resell them and $15,000. Um, how about 17? I really shouldn't do 17, but they're really, really cool. You got a deal, 17,000. 17,000. All right, I'll get you a check, and Alex will box them up. Sounds great. This is really, really cool. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Almost every guy wants a 200-year-old cannon. The problem is no one has space to put one. But anybody can find space for these bad boys, and that's why they're going to sell so easy. 